Seoul, North Korea fired another missile over the northern Japanese island of Hokkaido on Friday morning, just a day after Pyongyang said that Japan should be sunken into the sea with a nuclear bomb and that the United States should be beaten to death with a stick fit for a rabid dog. This was the second time in less than three weeks that North Korea sent a ballistic missile over Japan. And the launch came less than two weeks after North Korea exploded what is widely believed to be a hydrogen bomb. The latest launch immediately sparked angry reactions from Tokyo and Seoul. Secretary of State Rex Tillerson said the international community had to unite to punish Kim Jong-un's regime calling this week's UN Security Council sanctions, the floor, not the ceiling. China supplies North Korea with most of its oil. Russia is the largest employer of North Korean forced labor. Tillerson said in a statement, singling out the two veto-wielding members of the UN Security Council, who are also the closest thing to allies that North Korea has. China and Russia must indicate their intolerance for these reckless missile launches by taking direct actions of their own, he said. The missile was launched from the Sun and airfield just north of Pyongyang about 6.30 a.m. local time, South Korea's Joint Chiefs of Staff said. It flew 2,300 miles over 17 minutes, passing over Hokkaido and landing some 1,200 miles to the east in the Pacific Ocean.